Hello again. In this section, I will show you uh, components of your hardware. Uh, how you see your hardware components uh, in your Solaris operating system. Uh, my Solaris operating system is Solaris 11.2, and I will run some commands and uh, I will explain detailed uh, with your CPU, memory, and uh, disk uh, on your hardware and uh, uh, some information of that. Uh, let's start. In uh, Solaris 11 operating system, uh, you can see uh, there was some change. Which one is uh, very important? Top command. Top command is uh, come to Solaris 11. Uh, it was not used in Solaris 10 because uh, it was a third party tool in Solaris uh, 10 and it was not very successfully. But now in Solaris 11, you can see your uh, components usage, important components usage of your system, which is memory, CPU, and uh, any other uh, load average and uh, your uptimes, uh, something else. Uh, as you see in here, uh, you have 8 gigabyte physical memory, and uh, unusable physical memory size is 400 megabyte. And for your swap, swap inform information, 4 GB total swap you have, and uh, which is almost free usage. No usage of your swap because uh, you have free memory at the moment. And in your CPU, your CPU is almost 99% is ideal. And uh, only sometimes 0.1% is kernel usage, as you see in here and which is almost 100% uh, free. Your load average is also uh, depends on your CPU usage, which is 0, 0, 0. It is very perfect usage because there is no uh, any application on our uh, server. Now I will check my swap and memory with this, some different commands without top because in your Solaris 10 systems, you are not using your top command. Yeah, the conf pipe grab, sorry, minus E memory size. Okay, your memory size is here, 8 gigabyte memory on your system, which is physical memory. And for swap usage, minus LH human readable, which is 4 gigabytes uh, memory, you swap memory you have. Uh, for the usage swap memory, minus S, or minus L. Yeah. You are currently available 4 GB swap memory is in your system. Now, I will show the CPU information, CPU thread and uh, thread and socket and core information I will show you PRD sorry info minus virtual processor yeah you have eight virtual processor in your system which mean is you have eight thread on your system if I want to see whole CPU component or memory component on the system uh, I will run PRTDOC minus pipe more. Yes, let's check in detail. Which is Spark T5 2 system, and my system memory size is 8 gigabyte. My CPU is 8 thread, it starts 0 up to uh, seven, it's eight threads, and let's continue. There are two memory block. First one is one hundred twenty-eight. Second one is one hundred twenty-eight, and totally two hundred fifty-six gigabyte memory we have, but only eight gigabyte memory we are using in our system. Let's continue. This is my I.O. devices on our T5. Yeah.
motherboard USB Net Zero, which is onboard, uh, um, onboard uh, network cards, and which is LSI uh, for LSI card for uh, my hard drives, uh, which is Net3, which is also uh, my onboard, and second LSI controller for uh, second PCI controller. And let's continue. Which are fan status, fan sensor status, temperature status. As you see in status are okay. There is no any hardware issue on my system. Yeah. They are sensor of the uh, memory channel zero dim channel zero dim zero. Sorry. Sorry for Turkish. Yeah. Yeah, full okay. Fun board, fun zero, fun one. They are steady, okay. Service, service led is off. <coughs> Fun status enable enable they are running fine. Yes, for suspect planes, hard disk drives. There are four hard disk drives uh, on my system, and my system firmware is nine three zero, which is uh, system firmware, and uh, which is Spark system. For this reason, we have OBP OK, OK prompt. Uh, on my system which is 436.2 and when you apply the firmware to the system uh, I show that I see that uh, my OBP will be changed if I update my firmware because it is uh, dependent on the firmware uh, they contains system firmware contains OBP and some uh, other information of the uh, driver uh, of the hardware Yes, this is my serial number of the system. And actually, you see uh, some information which is different in this command because we are using uh, virtualization of the Spark on our system. And only 8 gigabyte memory I use and only 8 gigabyte, 8 uh, visual CPU I use in here. Uh, and other IO informations are uh, using seen with using LDM list devices command and they are free we can use this uh, memory for our uh, other guest domains LDOM domains for our virtual domains virtual server and they are CPU our CPU that can be which is CPU that can be used for uh, other system yeah which is core ID and threads there are uh, 32 core which is two socket and 656 sorry 256 uh, which CPU we have on the system yes as you see in here yeah, it starts from zero to here, 256 virtual CPU. And let's check the network, network components. Show link, show you your network components. Yeah, you have one, two, three, four, five, six network port in your system. Let's check it for the PCIs. Sorry. Five six. Yes. Which are on board? Which are on board four ports you have and the others net six and net four for visualization. You are not using that. On your system you have only four ports. Uh, which are for your uh, located on your uh, motherboard. Yeah. 
let's continue your disks for format command yeah actually as you see in here your LSI logical volume 300 gigabytes approximately 300 sorry 300 gigabytes uh, uh, volume in here uh, which mean is you have uh, two disks from your controller 2 and which is rate and approximately uh, 278 gigabyte because there is file system inside of that uh, LSI file system and you can check the second disk on the second controller as you remember that we have four uh, hard disk drive which were uh, 300 gigabyte and we mirrored them uh, with red one uh, it was approximately 278 gigabyte totally and two disks if you have any problem on your disk you can just unplug and plug it uh, in your system no need any uh, action on your operating system yeah let's check status of your operating system pool yeah our pool is online we can use list yeah our pool is online and second disk is not using only controller 2 disk is using on my uh, ZFS storage pool which is our pool and it is 190 gigabytes free uh, which is online no problem in here uh, now I will check my disk on the uh, hardware rate side rate config list all minus verbose five more I used to uh, hard rate volume on my system and that contains two volume yeah which is controller zero which is red volume is two let's continue red volume c0 r0 and disk c0 sorry uh, d0 and c0 d1 the status is okay yeah second disk is okay let's continue for the controller one there is red volume inside of that also controller one are zero yeah status is okay let's check the disks in here status is okay which is for first disk c1 d0 and c1 d1 which is second one which is okay yeah in this section i show you uh, list the components of the of your hardware oracle hardware uh, in solaris 11 operating system uh, it is very easy very easy to understand your components in your system but you should check your uh, component your environment which is spark or x86 uh, uh, environment because it is approximately change uh, with each other and here you are thank you to listen to me see you soon